Hi, I'm Yu Xinyang. I graduated in fashion visual merchandising and branding from University of the Arts London. In my undergraduate study, I learned various business knowledges and experimented with sustainable materials to create fabulous window and store display. The Miu Miu Pop-Up Store project is an extension of my BA final major project, and it combines my undergraduate business contents with interior design. So in this project, I use Miu Miu Snow Mountain Show as an inspiration, and it made me think about the environmental issues, which is global warming. This had led to the glass melting, so I used this concept and create flexible furniture for the pop-up store. And this furniture has multiple uses by changing their distribution in order to fit the movable and flexible of the pop-up store. Also, I have used recycled materials and designed workshop space in the store because I want to make more people aware of these issues. Through this extensive experience, I found that the interior is not only a space but also can bring different emotions and stories. Interior is not only the inner space, it is also an environment or atmosphere. For example, in my opinion, Earth is a space and all the inside is interior. So interior design is not just for humans, but also for creatures. It interests me most and that's the reason I want to study interior design for my master. Interior is an environment, so I noticed the environmental issues. When I traveled to Bali, I saw a dirty layer of oil floating on the sea. And I want to do something to protect the sea. So in my portfolio, some projects are inspired by environmental issues. And I want more people to realize the issues, so I want to express through interior design. One of the projects is to design a new habitat for endangered sea life. The inspiration is from the Ocean Pollution Exhibition and people have overexploited the oceans, resulting in the pollution of creatures in them. So at the beginning, I have analyzed the different types of sea dragons, which located in several areas. And then I used their body part, which transformed before and after, because the new habitat needs to fit their new body. So in the later design of the islands, I have used the same transform way, like enlarge, symmetry, and straighten. And finally, I create a main island and four variable islands for different locations all over the world. In this project, I not only want to express the environmental issues, but also to use several design expressions, design techniques, and software that break away from traditional interior design to find a new way. The Alice in Wonderland project is also use the new design techniques and create a space that doesn't exist in the real world. So in this project, I have analyzed their personality of each character through the movie and create several houses for them. Through the movie, I know the functions needed for each character and I also made a model. The house and furniture is made by 3D printing with acrylic paint outside. The base is used foam board and covered by soft clay. And finally, I use real bubble to cover the house. In my postgraduate study, I hope I can design interior from a business perspective and learn more skills to develop my design capability in Westminster. Thank you.